Hey guys, this is Risk here with episode number six of Mechanic Drills. Now it's been a long time since our last episode, and I'm gonna have to forewarn you that videos are gonna be released at a slower rate with the SAT coming up, just in terms of studying for all of that. But that's not gonna stop us from making today's um, episode. So this is gonna be part two of episodes in terms of mechanic drills things that you can do out of game um our last drill which i'll have in the description below is talking about your mouse mechanics and in terms of mouse accuracy today this one is going to be talking about finger speed things that you can work on and being able to essentially be looking be doing a task without really thinking about it while moving your attention to the next thing. So what that's going to consist of is two drills. One of them is called fastfingers.com and the other one is simply literally called multitask. I'm going to go to monitor share. There we go. So you can look up fast fingers and this will be the first thing that comes up. Now this is a drill that TLO does 15 minutes a day still to this day. Still does it for 15 minutes. And essentially it's a one minute typing test where very easy words, but the key is is that as you're typing extremely rapidly, you're going to be looking at the next word while you're typing the previous word, which is seems like at first you're like, why is that important? It just seems like it's just a typing test. But if you're able to do a task so quickly that you're looking at the, uh, the next task while you're doing the previous task, that's something that really, really translates over to StarCraft. You have to be able to do something while anticipating your next move. For instance, if you're stopping two drops, you should be able to stop the first drop without even thinking while moving your eyes and preparing for the next one. The actions and motions that you do in your mind, you have to be able to do a task without really thinking about it. So you give your, t um, your brain time to think about the next task. So I'll just do a quick typing test here. Not only that, the upside of this drill is that, well, you'll be typing faster. And in StarCraft, quick fingers, unlike common belief, yes, APM is important. I've never seen a guy with 50 APM get to GM. I'm sorry, it doesn't happen. And no, I don't want to hear about the Protoss memes that they take less APM. It's not true. I mean, maybe a tiny bit, but it's really, being fast is very important. So let's just go ahead and begin here. And as I'm typing, I'm actually looking at the next word before I even finish the previous word. You'll probably notice the same thing when you go as well. So 94 words per minute with five mistakes. Decent, not bad at all. And I would just encourage you to do that at least uh, two to three times. Not a very exciting drill, but it'll help your typing be faster, which is a plus side. It'll help you with anticipation, and it will also help you with finger speed. So that one is is kind of a, like people would say, that's kind of a stretch in terms of transferring over to StarCraft, but it's not. There's pros who do this, I promise you. Put a little, quite a bit of research into this one, trying to find um, two drills that would be very helpful. Because um, it's kind of hard to find really quality stuff out there that I believe actually helps you. So the next one, we can look up multitask, which seems like a really obvious thing to look up. But it's actually um, multitask. Wow, I don't know how to spell the struggle. Multitask game. Here we go. Ready to go. Play multitask. It's the first one. And here we go. The notes.
there we go I muted the music music is super annoying but um go ahead and do multitask one and not number two multitask one in my opinion is a lot better for helping you out improve so we're gonna start off here it starts off with just a bar that you're gonna balance back and forth using the right and left arrow keys pretty simple right picture this is spam boxing your hatchery or, or your nexus pretty easy to do right very simple and now now we're making supply depots while continuing to queue up SCVs look at that queuing up those probes while making pylons easy game easy life maybe you're focus starts to slip a little and now we're going to be essentially making units making supply depots and building SCVs so at this point my field of vision can only be really focused on one thing so I'm really using peripheral vision at this point quite a bit of it very applicable to StarCraft 2 Oh, whoa, 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 Oh, man. Struggle. Struggle is real. Struggle is real, boys. And now, we're going to be making units, building supply depots, building pylons, and harassing. And game over so 133 did pretty decent and that one's very applicable if you can't see the applications of that then I don't know why you're watching this video to be honest because that is Starcraft right there you have to be able to be able to do a task without really thinking about it and doing it seamlessly and that at the end when I died right there, what that represents is a mistake. Now in this in this game, that means game over. In StarCraft, the game keeps going on, but our goal is to play as flawless as possible, obviously, right? So this will let you be able to really start to manage more things without even really thinking about it. You're able to take in more information and kind of, I don't know how else to really ex explain it, except that you're like doing something and you're not really, your tension's not really there. Your attention is elsewhere, where more important small details that you can focus on. Building depots, not getting supply blocked, checking the mini-map, always building units. Those are things that you should be able to do without even really thinking. That's a component of being a great player, and you can work on that by doing this drill. Strongly, 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 strongly suggest playing this one. Super, super easy one to do. Strongly recommend. Um, fast finger is the first one maybe not maybe not as helpful as this one I think it's a very good one but this this helps this is applicable anyways that was mechanic drills episode number six our next mechanic drill will be an in game one so thank you for watching guys and this is risk signing out thanks for watching